Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm going to equip this. And in the meantime, I gave the herbs up to Rebecca and combined them to a new herbal mix. And so I'm prepared for what's coming up. I hope I am. <laughs> this is actually not uh, nothing you can really be prepared for. Uh, by the way, um, me? Uh, by the way, I wanted to say something. I forgot. Okay. So, we put... Wait, first of all, we open it and you see? There is a... This is the device where you can put gas in the room next door. At the moment, the device is empty. Okay. Then, we're gonna use this. The uh, I forgot the word again, but you know what I mean. And you see what will happen now. So the poisonous gas is going to be neutralized. And now the room is open. Oh gosh. <laughs> well, this is not the worst thing. So why should I bother? But I do bother, <laughs> actually. <laughs> Okay. Okay, you first? You want to get killed first? Turn, 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 Rebecca! Uh, she didn't turn! Oh. I hate that! Ah. Put him away! Yeah, come out. Come out. I'm prepared for you. There. Eat that badass. Okay, wait. Uh, 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 uh. See, she, she just needs one little stupid hit and she's on, on, on caution again. And it's something I hate. I really do. That means I have to heal her again. Because this was a breeding room key. And we have to go into the breeding room. And I fear... You won't get me down there. And I fear that going into the breeding room will get extremely annoying. Wow. I hate that. Unfortunately, and that is something I hate too, you cannot shoot the zombies on the floor, I even though you know that they will get up. But if they are just lying there, you cannot kill them. So, since she's on caution... Well, I think I can take another hit. Just have to be fast. He used the breeding room key. This key is useless now. Discard it? Yes. Okay, people. Wish me luck. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do it, let's do it. Okay, first of all, there's a file here on the floor. <laughs> And I have to read that. That's important. <coughs> it's the B.O.W. report. B.O.W. is for bioorganic weapon. Research to date has shown that when a progenitor virus is administrated to living organisms, violent cellular changes cause a breakdown in the system. Furthermore, no satisfactory method has been found to control the organisms for use as weapons. Clearly, greater coordination at the cellular level is essential to enable further growth. I conducted a number of experiments in an effort to find a breakthrough. This is my report. Insecta. Perhaps because of the ancient animals have been genetically stable for millennia, when administered with the progenitor virus, they exhibited only explosive high energy growth and increased aggressiveness. It is extremely difficult to envision using them as a B.O.W. Amphibia. Injecting a frog with the, with the virus resulted in an increase in leaping power and abnormal tongue growth. However, no change in mental ability is observed. Furthermore, an abnormal resulted in a test subject... An abnormal result in a test subject randomly attacking... Gosh, this is so hard. All moving object. Usefulness for B.O.W. is limited. Mammalia. 
the progenitor virus was merged with the monkey cellulia DNA, resulting in an increase in fertility. The resulting young exhibit improved aggressiveness and some increased mental capacity. As a side effect, the visual power was lost, this offset by an improvement in hearing ability. However, they were unsatisfactory as weapons. It does seem that no progress can be made without making humans as the base organism. Okay. I just... Okay, I need to heal. I need to heal. I need to heal. I, I don't. Now I need to heal. Get it! Get it! Oh yeah, I totally need to. I need to get him away from me. Okay. I have to kill him. Can I get him? In here. Okay, you can go through here without killing them. You can. It is possible. I did that in test run, but they were just cornering me, so I had to kill them. And in my test run, actually, I had no more ammunition, so... <laughs> but well, I don't have am any more ammunition right now, too. Yeah, just one left. That sucks. Okay, well, there could be worse. So, let's get out of here. And now we, you saw I just picked up that dial thingy. And there's something we have to give to Billy. But at least I'm out of that stupid braiding room. Make me nervous. Okay, this is the... No, I wanted to equip that. I hope that will be enough. So, we have to go here. <sighs> I hate this hunter part, I really do. I think I, I, yeah, I already re re uh, explained the origin of the hunters. So I don't have to do that anymore. But there's a lot I can, a lot more I can tell you. And um, yeah, but I will wait for that until the right time has come. So thing is, this other guy that was lying in the corner is getting up now. I know he does. I know that you want to get up. Well, probably it happens afterwards. Okay. I have to put the dial into this. <laughs> and send it down. Oh, that was something. I just made it through with the hunters without shooting them. I just ran th through there. Was in danger in a test run. And then I came back here. And that guy was getting up and killed me. What the heck? Why aren't you doing that right now? Oh yeah, by the way. Just uh, to tell you, there is a, a first aid spray here. I think we should take that with us. Okay, if you don't want to get up, then I'll just leave the room and go someplace safe. I don't want to stay here and wait for, for Billy. I really don't. We have to go here to the next door and we have to get the hookshot because we need to u we have to use the hookshot once more. And this is really annoying that you have to use the hookshot all the time because it takes up two of the slots and the two slots you abs uh, absolutely need for, um, for recovery items. And you have no chance to put down any recovery items because of this I wanted to get the hook shot. Now I didn't do it. Okay, well, who cares? Who cares? I'll just stay here. There is green herb. There are bottles. Oh, I have two spaces. That's good. Okay, then I just switch to Billy. Let's see if he already moved and if his little friend got up and played with him. No, didn't. Okay. So we'll get the dial. Le dial. There's something inside. You can't carry that. Oh, no. This game wants to tease me. This game wants to tease me all the time. Okay. Hmm? 
<laughs> no, wait. I'm going to send that. I'm going to send something up to her. Because uh, this is the last time we will be in this room. Oh, since I can't pick that up, I can't even send her something. Oh my god! Ugh. Oh gosh, there's a spider right above me. I need my vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I hate that. Where did all those spiders come from? And my chinchillas are hating each other at the moment. So everybody is hating each other here. I, the spider, my chinchillas, each other. Everything's hate. Everyone is hating everyone else. This is sad. Okay, take the dial. Yeah, dial in German. You saw that they wrote uh, Zahlenscheibe. That is actually. Um, yeah, I can't explain that. You you use the same word for uh, the old phone bo uh, phones. They had that uh, dialing thing to that uh, that goes round. That you use that too for. So, I do not know if it's the I, I think it's the same in, in English. Let's get that up. Yep. Okay. So, finally. Oh, wait, I wanted to check if the guy is dead, but I don't think he is. Nope, he's just sitting there relaxing. Okay, I'll let him relax. Let him be happy forever. Let's get in there. Oh, I can't believe I made it out of here and I still have two first aid sprays. Okay, I shouldn't have said that, probably. But yeah, well. Hmm. Who knows. So, now that we have the dial... We... Can go to this door here. I think we have to step... What the heck, Billy? Are you dancing? We have to step right in front of it or else the game is... Telling me not to... That I can't use it anymore. Okay, use this. And now, the device is working again. You want to enter a combination or a code? Yes. Enter the first number. Left, right, turn, A button, open. Okay, so we know the first number is number four, because four leeches. Enter the second number. The second number was eight, because we remember they doubled up. So, eight. Enter the third number. So we know now he lost two. So to the six. And now enter the last number. We know they were only half the number after a while. So we go to the number three. And then we open the door. Well, let's get in there. Yes. Another progressy episode. I like progress. Progress is very good. It's healthy for my, uh, for my mood. Maybe I could use this. We're back in here. Oh, Let's look at that. Billy, sporty I found spice. something here that might make you happy. It's an aerial cable car. Really? That's now we can get out. Yep. Let's regroup as soon as possible. Over. Okay, dog. The first thing is I have to show you that scared scared me a lot. I went back here. Uh, when you go here and turn around, to me it looks like if you look to the end of the room, that something someone is standing there. I, I absolutely don't know if you have the same uh, same idea, but I really think that looks like someone is standing there. And I was like, oh my God, Gilwin, don't move. Someone is there. And the other one wasn't moving either. <laughs> okay, there's a lever. Switch it, yes. Or flip it, however. Weak. There we go. So, and something is shining over there. I think we can carry anymore. Can we? Oh, I can. Cool. And this is the output rack coil. 
So we have the input rack coil and the output rack coil. So we have two rack coils. I guess rack is might be for regulation, I'm not quite sure. Probably someone already uh, commented that, but since I'm in a recording session, I have no possibility to uh, tell if all someone already did that. Okay, so we're up here and we're back. And we can do some regrouping here. Isn't that wonderful? And yeah, we will see each other in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. And have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.